Today we have corn on the cob, collard greens, fresh bananas. Boxes and bags of colorful produce fill tables set up in the parking lot behind the Greater New Bedford Community Health Center. We're feeding um, about 250 families in the New Bedford area. Leticia Caban, a patient community advocate at the center, Esta es su primera, su primera vez. helps check people in at the mobile market. It's an awesome feeling to know that we're helping people who are in need. She knows what it feels like to need help getting healthy foods. I was one of those people um, many years ago when I wasn't working who accepted this type of help. And I still do now, you know, so I'm extremely grateful. The mobile market is held once a month. It's part of the Greater Boston Food Bank's initiative to get fresh food to neighbors in underserved communities. It's just a great feeling inside to know that we're helping them. The market here in New Bedford is one of 75 organized by the Greater Boston Food Bank, serving people from here to New Hampshire and from the edge of Worcester County out to the Cape. We are bringing fresh produce and other healthy and nutritious items right to where the clients are. It's pretty heavy. <laughs> Christina Peretti works at the Greater Boston Food Bank. She says getting healthy fruits and vegetables to people who need it for free is essential. It was challenging pre-pandemic and now it is even more challenging. Um, things like lack of transportation, um, options that are available during hours when people are working. As the line grows, even in the rain, Peretti says food insecurity is everywhere and everyone can help end it. Whether it's volunteering or donating or, you know, spreading awareness. Um, everybody can play a role in ending food insecurity. In New Bedford, Emily Maha, WCVB News Center 5.